ago, uh, the former commander of the Wounded Warrior Battalion at Fort Knox, Lieutenant Colonel David Haynes, sent me an email and said, the ride to recovery, we're going to have 200 wounded warriors coming through on their bicycles. Would U of L like to host us? And I said, we would love to host you. This is a big deal for us. Thank you for uh, being here. Welcome to the campus of the University of Louisville. Welcome to Louisville. You visiting with us uh, means uh, so much to us because it gives us the opportunity to say thank you to you. Thank you for your service to our country. Thank you for all that you've done. I got involved when I was actually a soldier in transition myself, uh, wounded in action in Afghanistan. And uh, of course, cardio was my main activity, but I couldn't run like normally did, so I decided to uh, go to something different where it was cycling. It's six days of riding six days of riding and I, today is my first day on an upright. I'm normally on a trike. So that's part of the program with Ride to Recovery is getting to graduate up to the better levels. And so today is my day of graduation to the upright bike. Ride to Recovery is all, is exactly what the title says. It's setting goals for wounded warriors to try to achieve during this 300 mile trek. They started in Cincinnati and they will finish in Nashville. So U of L was at about the 100 mile mark. And, you know, we are a military friendly university, fourth year in a row awarded that. This is something that we love to do. We have a great partnership with the military at Fort Knox, a great partnership with the Kentucky National Guard. There was no way I was going to say no.